Hello friends and welcome to Pi Shine. This is part 20 of the Pi QT5 learning series. Today, you will learn how to make an application installer for the Windows platform. Alright, let's make an installer for a simple calculator application. At first, we need a PNG image to be used as display icon. Then, we will copy the UI and Pi codes from pyshine.com. The calc.ui file contains all the script for the user interface. Next, we will copy and paste the Python script. Alright, now run the application. The calculator is working fine, so let's move towards the next step. Here, we will download and install the Inno Setup executable file. Inno Setup is a free installer for Windows programs. First introduced in 1997, it today rivals and even surpasses many commercial installers in feature set and stability. Its features include extensive support for installation of applications on the 64-bit editions of Windows, the X64, ARM64, and Itanium architectures are all supported. It also supports creation of a single executable file to install your program for easy online distribution. It's free of charge and can do multilingual, password encrypted installs digitally signed installs and uninstalls. Alright, let's cancel it and go for the next step. We need Pi Installer to generate the important files for the deployment of application. Now, we will pass this command to generate the distribution files. Pi Installer analyzes your code to discover every other module and library your script needs in order to execute. Then, it collects copies of all those files, including the active Python interpreter, and puts them with the script in a single folder or optionally in a single executable file. We can observe that there are some directories and files generated. We need the disk directory for the next step. It has some files and a directory. The files include calc executable to run the application. By default, we have a console enabled, along with the GUI. Now, we will make a new data directory, and move the existing directories or folders, to it. All right, let's move to the next step with Inno Setup. 
Here, we will use the script wizard. Give the name, version, and other information accordingly, for the application. Click Next, and provide the paths of files, and data folder as shown. This is our main executable file. Now, Select all the files except this executable, and click Open. Next is to select the data folder. Click Yes to accept subfolders as well. Here, we can give a file name, and a password. Once the process is finished, we will have our distribution setup file. It will compress and package all the essential files to a single installer. Click on the Build Open Output folder. That's it, we have the setup file ready to distribute. Let's try to install and run the application. That's all for today. Have a nice day and see you again.